Yes, good morning, it's me Luis. So we have this one, it's a brand new 2017, but it's gonna be the same in 18 for the Volkswagen Atlas. So we're gonna replace the windshield because uh, it's a factory part, so I'm gonna have OEM part. So sorry if I didn't put the videos in the last days, but I remember YouTube, you cannot make videos anymore. So you cannot edit those videos. So I have to find another way to edit the videos and just don't house on my computer. So today I would inspect this car is brand new. So I didn't find any damage. So it's totally new, brand new. So remember this one, I don't see any any chains. And this one is, is really nice. It's really big this time. The windshield is really, not really high, but it's more a little longer. The bend is a little bit on the corners, but just on the bottom, so it's no big deal. I'm gonna use the spider today because I wanna go fast. Remember, the review mirror is gonna be the same like the Audis because this is partner of the Volkswagen, so I don't think we're gonna find any problem on this new model. So let's start. I know that we have a couple of clips, the same like the Audi, so every Volkswagen does, uh, has this kind of clips of attainers on the cows. So it's just three. Now we have our uh, wipers on, but it's the same like the other Jettas or any kind, T1s so or any car of those Volkswagen and Audis. Now maybe, this I'm, I would need a tractor, I'm not sure, but I will find out if I need a tractor. I bought a new one because the small ones I don't have, I have problems to pull the Panamera, the 18s. Uh, you need this tractor before you don't have to use a tractor for the Panamera the 2018 but the new ones you must have one it's really difficult well this one is not big deal that one might be the problem it's too short the same like the Panameras the new models they come in this way short and I cannot pull it without a tractor so let me see if I can um, but I think that one looks really tight so let me try I use my new uh, tractor it's right here this from equalizer so I'm gonna see how good is this one so it looks pretty nice let's see we can uh the only problem sometimes is this kind of cows the Panamera is too tight either so but I think it's gonna be fine you see the problem with these ones is to go exactly in that way but I don't think it's gonna be too much problem so it's probably right there. It's a little tight. Now let me turn here. Let me see what. There you go. Make it in. There you go. It was more easy. So I recommend this one definitely. The problem is this one I have a lot of room, but if I have something short and this way, I'm gonna use the other one. But this one works pretty nice. So it's more heavy duty. Okay, remember this one right there. The rest, remember, is the same like the other Jettas. Now the nice, we don't have moldings besides, so that's the good news. So no more those moldings beside because sometimes they give us some problems when they are older. Man, I like when they are brand new and you got a hooks right here, just careful. Because that one they're gonna hold your uh, cow on place so don't, don't break those. Ah oh, yes, so my line is already in for my uh, spider. So I'm gonna just sit down one now. Okay. So on this line I already broke one little piece, so I have to just cut this little bit. Because I have a Problem one windshield, it's the old ones. What was a I think it was a Honda, the old ones, and my line being stressed because they have a lot of glue. I don't have the video for that one, but they put a lot of glue. And I tried to use my spider and they broke my line, so that's why I don't like to use my tools on those kind of cars. Those kind of jobs. 
Yeah, they mess with tools, so that's why. Uh, let me open this one a little bit. It's a little tight here. There you go. You see, the part of the top is really tight. It's less than a little 11 16 probably or 32 so it's really small so no blades can go on that way so you see that one it's almost nothing look at the difference that one you have room this one nothing it's completely tight so what you're gonna do here this is probably a problem with the factory when they set the windshield so they go too high on that way so let me cut the mold a little bit see if i have a room if not i have to use my other blade the other technique I use, remember my, uh, I got it disordered, it's Friday, so remember I have to fix all this. So if not, I have to use this kind of blade, okay? Because there's nothing is gonna stick in that side. Let me see if, if I can uh, put my line, put in the rubber. Remember, no deep, okay, just the itch. Don't go deep, but you're gonna scratch the pitch wheel, so. And even the blade, don't go more, you see? Let's see what happened. Just careful here. Probably... Only problem is here, it's really tight. Let me see if I can <clears throat> just insert this line without cut one piece here let me see because it's really really low tight on it there you go perfect all right a little short now because i broke my line in another job what i said before so, but it's gonna be fine. I'm gonna go in this direction because I don't wanna just, this, this is gonna start turning. You gotta go this way, but I'm gonna go the other side because I don't wanna this thing turn. Just careful here with the metal. Make sure we don't catch, like this one, it's catching the pitch wheel. So go up. Ready, ready, low. That's why in all the jobs I do always pull this molding because this one sometimes gives you problems to fit here when you take them off so you have all the room inside. So let's go inside, pull the brackets and for the video mirror and we will start this cut. Now the problem I have, remember I'm short in my tool right here so I'm gonna start making little cuts because I, um, I didn't want to run more lines so I'm gonna start cutting a little bit right here. So remember I have to go in the middle but I need more line because I think my P8 I'm gonna finish my P8 so I need to order so to remember the cover behind is a little tight just go behind this one not much like that I remember the spider here and remember your uh, regular sensor here I got the sound in front of me so I don't see okay right here just push the pin a little bit there you go. and a little pressure not too much okay there you go. we gotta re reuse the sensor or they have to give you a new one and sometimes they one they don't have it so they gotta be ordered and the customer is pick it up today so there you go okay remember i'm gonna make a little cuts because i'm short in this line so that's why i'm gonna stand this way
Okay, and this way now it's like I'm working regular. I'm a little down, I have to go more up. So after this, I'm gonna change the line, okay? Remember now, I'm going like the any position before, my four inches, and we're ready. Now this one, if uh, what I said before, you go all the way here, you can. The only problem is going to be like this. If I go here, you see, I'm going to be almost touching my headline and I don't want to do that. So I'm going to go break in here. And this way is better. Yeah, it's really soft this glue, but the problem is on this corner. And the next one I'm gonna do, I'm gonna find if it's uh, maybe the problem with the with the factory because they left this this part too high, or what happened? Or is the only one? Because that's what I find now. It's too low. It's too high. I mean. the last cat. Okay, remember both wagon coming very easy, but sometimes the designs, like this one was like, a, it's gonna be a fine and easy job, but the problem is this kind of top is too high but I don't think it's gonna be a problem okay so let me hold this windshield and I gotta go apart and pick up my glass I'm really ready this job is faster oh, sorry about that camera is fine yes okay and this line I'm gonna be placing because it's too short I have a piece broken because uh, I could, I mean, I cut one little piece because uh, for another job I did, it was really bad. I couldn't record it because the customer don't want to record it, but it was bad, okay? So, let me pull this one out. It's a little bigger, but it's not really high. There you go. Today we're a little slow, guys, because this month is gonna be slow for me. My best days in summer, but today I'm gonna be slow, but 
still I'm gonna post videos, okay? All right, so as you see, we got a low glue, no problems, no damage, pretty close to heat. Okay guys, so I'm gonna clean, get my glass, and I'll be right back to set, and we finish because look at the sky. I hope it's gonna rain. So we're okay, going to set, wait six minutes on my uh, clear primer. Remember, it does have a frit, just use a clear primer. It doesn't have a frit, remember, go with 5504, and twice primer, okay? After you just and contaminate the glass with the F1. So now, I'm gonna set this one with my WRD. Now remember, the key to control this kind of set with this system is this one right here. Because if this one you go too high, your glass is gonna turn too fast on the bottom. Now you go too high, too low, sorry, you're gonna hit the frame or you're gonna, this, this part is gonna turn too fast. So you have to be exactly at one place. So in this case, if I set here, I need to control my arm because this one is going to control your glass, the weight of the glass, okay? So I'm going to make a dry test to show you what's the problem when you don't set this one on the right way, okay? How important is this, this one right here? So I'm going to hold right here. This one I feel the control, but when you set this one on your side arm right here, you see, when I turn this one, my glass turned fast you see that so that's the problem this one i feel a lot of pressure on the bottom and it's going to make more difficult my set because my glass want to turn on the bottom you see i can control but it's going to hurt a little bit my arm so right there so you see the set here it's nice so it's good so the problem is this one you go this way too much there's a problem you have you have to go an angle like this And now the difference is you're gonna control, you see? It's not making any turn too fast on my arm. And I can control this one more, okay? So careful when you set this one, because that's the only problem you can have. Now, if I'm too close to the video mirror, I can just go on this way. And we can go beside here. And just go around here, okay? So you can just choose this one oh the front if you're close to the review mirror so let's gonna set the glue because we're ready i don't know it's gonna rain now it's gonna clear but that side on town is really floating all right we're gonna start setting on the passenger side now the top molding is replaced because the factory molding come with damage really bad because in the boxes uh, they got some protections here and they damage the top molding, so I have to use the universal molding now. I remember this one doesn't have anything special. The set is gonna be close to the molding, okay? This one I went too close to the edge, so to prevent the glue is gonna show up, I have to just make the glue go inside. So I'm gonna use my stick, my bone, and I have to push it inside. If no, I'm gonna show up like this. I'm gonna go push in, you see, from the bottom, and you're gonna push inside the glue, going inside right there. Okay, so in this way, your glue is not gonna show up too much. And after that, just put a straight. And there you go. Remember, this kind of pitch wheel is like a little bended, so it's gonna help to the glue don't show up too much. This one we're good, and ready to set. All right. We're 
I'm gonna set here and my set has to be exactly in the point with not push the glue out so I'm gonna just set right there set right there I just leave space right here let me get my suction caps because I don't want is get glue inside and outside this is the only concern with these new models we don't want to have any kind of even they change this design on the top go up a little bit I like more the Sika because Express I remember was really thick on the old days but now it's really soft and sometimes you know I like more the thick ones because when you sit don't move anymore okay now we're gonna set this one go on the top very high so let me get the molding fit like that the number is fine I'm a little more on this way so I'm gonna go more on this high I gotta just push it down and it's gonna close the gap okay there's a machine there you go Now I'm higher but all the glass is gonna be high in the same sides because before it was too much on the top not much on the passenger side all right guys so we finished here so I'm just gonna put all parts together and we finish okay so see you next shot for morning style see you next